Hi guys, this is AC Game Mob back with another video on Counter Side. So, like I said and like I promised, I will be making like four videos every single day uh, when Counter Side is released, as well as the day before it releases. Now, whilst I'm recording this video, it is currently on the 26th of uh, May. Right now, you can actually pre-download the um, Counter Side game. However, the server isn't officially out. The server will be officially out on the 27th, so we do need to wait. So, on the 27th of May, the server should hopefully open on at 2 a.m um, uk time and um yeah what i'm going to be doing in today's video is going over how to re-roll now this is definitely going to be important i'd recommend re-rolling because obviously you can get yourself an awakened character you can also get yourself two other ssr characters even four more ssr characters as well as well as, as assuming your luck is obviously good but this is going to be very very helpful now to show you guys this re-roll guide i'll show you how to re-roll i will be using the sea server this the apk file for the global server is still going to be the same in terms of how to re-roll but they will give you additional method or um, additional summons so you can actually reroll and you increase your chance of getting an SSR character. So I have actually created a new account. So we're going to go through the tutorial. It should take six to seven minutes to play the tutorial, assuming you skip everything. So what you want to do is skip through the dialogue and play through this. So I will be doing that right now. If it is too long, I will definitely cut it. But you want to play through the tutorial. Now with the release of Counter Side, I hope everyone is hyped. Um, I, I really do want to see Counter Side succeed. Um, obviously, um, counter side. I've been playing the SEA server for a while, so I actually know the ins and outs of counter side. So if you guys don't want to miss out on upcoming guides and future content on the game, make sure you all subscribe. Make sure that post notification is on. And if you guys enjoyed this video or found this video helpful, make sure you click the like button. It helps out with the algorithm, and it also help um, other people find this video as well. It's going to be important. It help out your fellow gamers as well. Now, unlike with the um, SEA server when it got released, you actually will not only be rerolling for SSR characters or normal SSR character, Awakening Hildur will be available on day one and rerolling for her will make the early, early game um, much more easier. And she's still um, used in endgame in the SEA server. Um, she's very, very tanky and definitely a must reroll for. So assuming everyone is lucky or everyone rerolls, you should all have an Awakened Hildy so that you guys shouldn't be annoyed when you go into PvP and a lot of Awakened Hildy are running around because that boy is she going to be very very hard to kill. But um, yeah, in this reroll guide, you're not only rerolling for SSR characters, you're also rerolling for an SR units as well. There is three particular um, SR characters you want to get or four particular, no actually just three because one of them is given to you. There's three SR units you want to reroll for as well and there's also um, three SR units you want to reroll and one um, um, what's it called? One Awakening SSR character as well. So in total, you're aiming for at least uh, one Awakening unit plus three normal characters. So that's four um, SSR units plus three good or the ones I'm going to talk about um, normal SR units. And then your count is going to be absolutely amazing. Now I will touch a, a little bit on the um, SR units you want to stay and reroll for, and I'll also talk a little bit about the um what's it called the ssr units you want to reroll for in this video but i do have a separate video planned out where i will talk in much more detail why you need to reroll for these characters with most other people's reroll guides all they talk about is the process of deleting your accounts and all of that stuff however in my video i will only i will also go over the places you should summon um, this is how you're going to get your free summons. This is how you're going to be getting your chance to summon SSR characters. Luckily in the SEA server, we do still have the 160 summon, which is going to be given to you guys on the global release as well. So this is one of the method or one way you actually will be doing your rerolls. So with this, they will give you free uh, multi. Now with this one, there is only a certain amount of SSR character you can actually get. So the available SSR characters from here are Carl Wong, Elizabeth Pendragon, Gayun, Seo Yoon, Esterosa, and Nanahara Shifuyu. Now with this, you're aiming to get an SSR character. It isn't guaranteed um, guaranteed banner where you are guaranteed an SSR character within the first multi. However, if you do three multis in this banner, you will get an SSR character. However, upon getting an SSR um, character, this will be removed. Um, so yeah, what you want to do is hopefully you get an SSR character within your first multi on this. And the one you're actually aiming for is the Nanahara Shifuyu as well as the Gayun. Those are the two ones you want to aim to get in this banner 
now specifically listen to me right now there's other good characters you can get from here but those are the two ones you are aiming for if you're going for a perfect reroll those are the two ones you're looking for if you get the unit fantastic if you get another harvest shifu fantastic however just in case you do get another ssr character you don't like or isn't recommended to get i will still recommend you guys to follow through with the rest of the summons that will be given to you with this account do not stop there and delete your account and start again don't do that so um let's go ahead and do that free multi over here they do give you the free currency required to actually do the summon um but let's see what do we get we are, okay so with this the little um robot next to the characters this means a guaranteed ssr so there we go let's look at what we got um i'm gonna skip through this because i want to make this fast okay i got lucky i got two of these characters this is fantastic so um although i didn't say um you should reroll for Kai Wong in this um you can actually get Kai Wong as well it's also fantastic um so i actually got two ssr characters from here elizabeth pendragon and Kai Wong. that was our first multi now the second multi is this one over here where you're guaranteed an ssr character every single time you do a multi now from here the characters you are able to get is Elizabeth, Geyun, Estorosa, Nanahara, Shifuyu, and Nanahara, Shinatsu. Now with this one, okay, maybe it's not guaranteed. Oh, it is a guaranteed SSR character. It was just a fake out. So let's go ahead and skip. The SSR character we got from here is Geyun. Now this is fantastic. I got Geyun and I have Kao Wong. Um, with this one, what you're aiming to get is Nanahara, Shifuyu, or Geyun. Once again, or you can actually get Estorosa. Those are the three characters you should aim for to get on this banner obviously i would tell you guys forget dupes do not get dupes at this moment all you want to do is just pull and get new ssr character with this all i'm going to do is confirm this because it's get you so i'm going to confirm this now you once again you do have 30 more trials for this so 30 is multi um there we go now this is going to be where you can actually now go into your mailbox now okay i did a oopsie but we'll go over to here we're just gonna hopefully not have to do any more challenges so after it brings you to here you can actually now go over to your mailbox and claim every single rewards available obviously right now the rewards here are going to be different with the global server however i do expect them to give you courts um, especially the pre-registration rewards as well with i believe a guaranteed ssr character some um, coins some courts as well courts is basically this and stamina as well when you level up um, so i'm just going to claim all of this right now um now luckily with the sea server i have been given uh, more courts than i believe the global server will get um you get a guaranteed SSR character from here this is also what you will get in the global server let's take a look at the characters available here you can actually this is a selector so what you want to go and get from here is either let's say you get go in already you already have the Kao wong you should get the Xiaolin. This is the character you want from this ticket. Xiaolin, unless you pull her from the normal summons they give you. But um, that is fine. You can do through, go through this. You'll hopefully be able to clear this within the seventh day stuff. Um, let's exit out. Now, another thing you will need to do when re-rolling is go over to shop. Very, very important. Your re-rolling does not end here. You want to go over to um, this. No, it's not. You want to go over to packages scroll down all the way to go over to recommended limited packages go over to the classified recruitment packages and you need to buy this now once again in the global server there is going to be a coupon which gives you 1500 quarts with the remaining quarts hopefully they give with the remaining um, quarts required hopefully the game does give you enough to actually do this so you just buy this straight away now you have enough to do a multi on the um awaken hildy banner so in the sa server we do not have awaken hildy but we're just going to do it on the horizon banner um there we go we do the multi we skip through that this is not the awaken character but we did get an ssr character and it's kyle wong once again we did not get the character we want but if you're one of those people who do not care about the awakened character you can still carry on doing summons the reason why i say that is you go over to normal recruitment and you guys will have 160 free summons now on that day you will not exactly get 160 you get 10 every single day so for 16 days you will get 160 or for 16 days you'll get a multi every single day but because i am in the sea server and this banner has been out for a while i can actually do the full 160 summon which yeah even if you miss a login date you can actually go back and do your summons that you missed which is fantastic but um there we go um we did the multi here you get an ssr character that's fantastic obviously the characters available in your um, banner is going to be different from the ones available here the characters you are re-rolling for is going to be i believe nanahara shifuyu if you don't have her still the um um over sr units as well also sorry i forgot to actually mention this but whilst you were doing that um, 30 
um, re-roll um, summon that's where you are guaranteed an SSR character you also want to re-roll for the um, um, SR units as well so you're hopefully aiming for Gayu Nana Hara Shifuyu alongside one or two of the um, SR units I talked about so Evelyn and Ling Sheng those are the characters you're re-rolling those are the SR units you're re-rolling for let's go over to employee so I can actually show you how they look like so that you guys don't actually miss out on those units um, I'm mentioning right now now um, unfortunately in the 30 free viewer summon the administration rifleman will not be available there so the one you're actually looking for is evelyn one this is one of the sr units you're aiming to get with that 30 summon the other one is going to be ling sheng this is another sr unit you're trying to reroll with that 30 free reroll summon and let's say you manage to pull a gay yun or you pull the nana of a for you with evelyn killer alongside ling sheng then your account is definitely stacked off at the end of the reroll the counters you want to get is either the Zhao Lin, um let's scroll down to Kao Wong this is a maybe um the Esterosa the Gay Yoon the Nanahara Shifuyu the awakened hildi if you guys get lucky with the awakened banner it is going to make your re-rolling a lot more painful to be honest if you're re-rolling for awakened um hildi but it's definitely something i recommend you guys to actually go ahead and do um i believe that is it for the ssr characters you're looking to get however we also managed or let's say you got like six ssr character and you guys managed to get this elizabeth she's all right the other one that you can actually go ahead and pick or try and get with the 160 summon i believe titan might be in the banner you could possibly go for him however it does fall off yeah later on in the game it does fall off so it's not a great investment to actually pull titan um and obviously i already talked about the sr characters you're looking for now there's one more thing i didn't talk about i actually forgot about this but um rosario is also going to be on in the banner so there is going to be a banner for rosario at the start of the game so let me show you how rosario looks like she is definitely a must-have as well so when you're re-rolling try and get her as well as you can see there's a lot of ssr characters i would tell you guys to try and get um but yeah rosario is definitely one of them obviously i do plan to make an in-depth guide on which um characters you definitely want to reroll for um that will come out later on right now it's just how to reroll the best place to reroll so this is rosario and um yeah she's great now that you've got an account that you do not want and you want to reroll um there is actually three ways to reroll assuming that the global server does give you the reset your account button in the setting page you can quickly go over to manage account and there should be a reset your account however in the sea server we do not have this function um maybe in the global server they might decide to change that and make it a lot easier for people to actually reroll but let's say in the global server there is not the reset your account stuff what you want to do now is go over close the application um clear data which is basically clear the cache you will be forced to re-download the free gigabytes um i will actually suggest using an emulator for example bluestack or ld player this will help speed up the process um if you guys want me to make a video on how to reroll on emulator tell me down in the comment section i really do hope that the account reset option is still available in the global server because uh, in a cbt the reset um, account option was actually there so i really do hope they stick with that and that is the way to revolt now this is definitely an in-depth video as you can see by how long I it took me to go and explain um, what to do but once again i'm only doing this for you guys because um, it is very important that you reroll obviously you just want to go into the game you don't care about which character then fine but at the end of the day don't complain about pvp being too hard when you don't have the obviously best characters um so yeah that is it for today's video guys i will be making more videos that should be coming out on the who to reroll so stay tuned for that it's been your boy ac gamer and i'm out was it the voice was it the fire burning in me